Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, how are you doing? Hopefully, you are doing better than good, better than most, better than that sometimes. And it's my honor to have meeting you tonight or this evening. I'm so glad that to meet you today. And as you know that we're going to continue, we're going to resume what we have already started. So right now, we're going to uh, talk about this, and this is from AAA Hello or Hello Triple This is from www.acomhello.com. I'm so glad to have you uh, this evening. It's my honor, my uh, privilege to have you this. And we're going to talk about the, the issues that we already raised. I mean, uh, we're going to talk the areas that we have already started talking about them. I'm going to resume uh, what I've already started talking about them. And these are uh, uh, proverbs, sayings, codes, and cliches. This is what I shed the light on. As I, as I told you, this is very vast area. It's very big area or a huge area to be tackled. Well, I'm trying to do my best. I'm trying to endeavor to get deep, to get my best out and to be talking about this. So I will be, I will be so glad, delighted to share this with your friends, with your colleagues and comrades and your loved ones, okay? So share this and don't forget to comment on the comment box that there's any ideas or new insights. I know that a lot of the uh, people who will come with new insights and brilliant ideas, and this will enhance the work that I'm already sorry talking about them, which is Sudanese folklore. By talking about this uh, cultural diversity or cultural uh, diversity, which will be a great honor for us to sharing this. And as you know that, as every single uh, person knows that, sharing is caring, and we have to contribute. Contribution is crucial. Because contribution is bottom line. So we need to contribute. And this American saying says that we are, we are ashamed. We are ashamed to die without any major contribution to the mankind. So we are here to do some. We are here to contribute. It's high time. There's call for us. And we, this generation, have to answer this call. It's high time. So let's do it. Let's share. Let's contribute. You and I, we can contribute to the mankind, to the universe. And this is a very slight thing or a little thing that I would like to share with the universe, which is the, the Sudanese uh, proverb saying, and on the coming days or upcoming days, I will be talking about the, the, the dancing and songs and the, uh, public songs and so forth. Okay, so right now let me uh, go quickly to what I've uh, provided for uh, this evening session or tonight session, and we're gonna talk about this uh, proverb, and we're gonna see them. Uh, as I told you earlier, I'm trying to make it clear as crystal or crystal clear that there's no. Bear in mind that, take into your own account and consideration that there's no identical synonym. As you know that, even if the twins are not so-called identical, so that's why there's no identical uh, proverb. But sometimes they have something to share. They have something in common. And this is what I'm trying to do. This is what I'm trying. I'm clinging to... Uh, perform and reflect on this area, okay? But there's no clear cut. Yeah, as you know that, and you do know that, a uh, proverb saying, quotes, cliche, all these are national or universal phenomena. 
So every something is certain community in a given situation or a given uh, community or a given context. Uh, every certain community has its own uh, proverb, culture, tradition, and so forth. So that's why it's not a exclusively and inclusively to a given a community or a given society. Okay. So this is something universal. Uh, today is we are on the, the proverb number sixteen. Okay. Uh, if the honor, if the honor of the goat is not afraid to travel by night, the honor of a hyena certainly will not be. Yeah, will not be. Yeah, yeah, will not be afraid. That's it, right? And this is Alexis. This number one. Number two, do not show a hyena how well you can buy. Yeah, you cannot tell that. You cannot show them, okay? Yeah, or show them uh, how you can, how skillful you are or you are buy, okay? And number three, when the hyena is gone, that is when the dog walks. When the dog walks, walks. Uh, the third one, when the goose, aha, uh -huh. this is another one. So the first one, maybe when we are talking about this, you, hyenas and uh, wolves and so forth. But this, the, the fourth one is somehow different from the above mentioned one. When the goose, G is uh, the plural form, uh, trust the fox. When woo ah, to her neck, what woo to her neck, and who has it translated in Arabic? It's called uh, when you undergo a very severe or hard situation, it might be, but in Arabic it's called wait, okay? So, who because these they don't trust them, so we are talking about trust, distrust, and mistrust, and this is uh, particularly about distrust. Uh, so let me uh, talk about this in, in the equivalent or the Darfurian one. Glad, uh, what are you saying? What are you talking? Glass coppers, lockers. Uh huh. Yeah. Glad, Is it clear? I wish it is. Uh, and there's another one which is similar to the Korean context. It's called Al Mafain Ma Bihalisule Ghanam. Al Mafain Ma Bihalisule Ghanam. And uh, this is very vivid. It's very clear that about to take care, to be cautious, and to take care of everything, uh, every action, as a single action, even your words, and uh, to be. Alert, and this is the core message or messages or themes of this uh, proverb. So, uh, this is what I would like to say, and this is uh, for uh, today's session. I'm so thankful that you're here, and it's my honor uh, really talking to you. And this is a uh, 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 hello. Yeah, uh, thank you very much indeed. Thank you for watching. Don't forget, as I told you, don't forget to share this with your friends and to let the others know more about our own culture, our own heritage. I'm trying to do my best, my utmost. I'm endeavor to get the best out. This is as far as I know, as far as I'm concerned. But maybe the others will come and they will start from where the others end. Thank you very much indeed. Uh, God bless you. And God bless our black country and all countries. And God bless us all. Thank you. Uh, see you next time, inshallah. Have a very nice, uh, uh, blessed, joyful weekend. Thank you. See you next week, inshallah, if we were alive.